Hi, I'm Jason Sims at Coffee House Films, and today I'm just going to give you a little tip on how I made my cloth to mesh or mesh to cloth mail script. So I toggle back and forth between my character in, in full mesh mode or full cloth mode. Right now, if you're looking at my little character, his name is Rogo, and all of the character, including the clothes, the, the, his, his skin, his eyes, his teeth, is actually cloth. So right now you're looking at him in cloth mode, and here we're seeing him as the original input mesh. Okay, so I'm going to show you real quick how just to make a, a cloth to mesh script for him. Uh, let me hide his hair so it'll kind of move around a little quicker. All right, I'm going to let's say make a little new shelf called demo, and we're going to go into the end cloth shelf. Where is this at? End cloth shelf. And what I like to do first, open up the script editor, and I like to clear everything out. So I'll clear all. So I'll go one piece at a time. I'm going to select his body mesh. View it as the current mesh which is the cloth. I'm going to do the same for his shirt. And all I have to do now is I don't have to go up here. I can just click G. Pants G. Shoes G. So the shoe G. Um, let's see for his hide his body his teeth teeth eyes and eyes okay so basically I went through his whole body I'm going to select let's see select the script drag it over a mail script okay I'll bring his body back okay now we can go the opposite direction go into end cloth but let me clear this clear out the script editor again Okay, we are going to select the end cloth version of the character and toggle him back to the original input mesh for his body. Again, G, 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 G. I'm going to hide the body. G, G. Select the script. Oops, let's see. Go back to the demo. Drag the script over. Mail script. Save as mail script. See the body. So now I want to go back. Let's see. Let me go and change the name. So I'm Let's see, so this would be the, I'll call this the mesh to cloth. I'll call it two because I already have one. And I'll call this one to mesh. Typically I would save that, I'm just not saving it because I already have this saved. So this would be cloth to mesh and mesh to cloth and they have it.